Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you may be. Today is in a, well, I don't want to call it an unboxing. I already unboxed it, but it, it's a happy mail video. I received happy mail from my dear friend Diamond Painting with Jack. Uh, Jack is such a sweet woman. She, uh, you know, she wrote me a little card. She was thinking of me. A lot of this stuff, she, uh, when she saw it, she, she thought of me and she just wanted to send some goodies my way and, and good luck with my surgery coming up in, um, August. So we're just going to get into this. I did unbox this all. I didn't, I wanted to get rid of the box. It had addresses and stuff on it and I didn't want to expose all that and it was really big. So she, first of all, she sent this little bag. I like this bag. I'm going to keep it. And she sent me some washi tape. Let's look at the washi tape. Don't mind the nails, guys. Still growing out the polish. Maybe I'll remove it today, finally. Oh, look, a Christmas one. I don't have any Christmas washi tape at you guys. I have Halloween washi tape. I'm prepared for the Halloween season, but I don't have any Christmas uh, washi tape. Oh, a rainbow one. This one would have came in such handy with one of my rainbow ladies. Well, if I ever buy another rainbow lady, at least I am prepared now. And, ooh, look at this one. This one has pastries. Very fitting, considering that I work in a bakery. Pies and cakes. Beautiful. What else? She sent me a little cover minder. Now, I I don't um, use cover minders anymore on my um, diamond painting because I use release paper. But I still like collecting cover minders. And I have a, I actually have a mini fridge in my basement and, um, it's actually coming upstairs to my bedroom for my, um, gastric sleeve surgery. So I can put all my protein shakes and all my protein waters and all my little cups of jello and stuff in there. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all my cover minders instead of keeping them in the drawer, I'm going to stick them on the mini fridge. So this will make it a cute addition on the mini fridge. Thank you. Oh, how stinking cute. Oh, hold on. They're stuck together. She sent me a Hello Kitty cover minder, you guys. You know how much I love Hello Kitty. You know how much Jack loves Hello Kitty. <laughs> that is so cute. I don't have any Hello Kitty cover minders as of right now. I have none. I really want to get a cinnamon roll one. I got to go look on Etsy. Don't get me started with Etsy. I just... I kind of, I, I haven't bought too much putty lately. Um, I bought a cup from a couple more shops that I haven't bought from, but now I bought some, um, custom made, uh, crochet hooks. So I'm still going on and on about <laughs> Etsy. And this is a unicorn with pink hair. I, you know how much I love pink, you guys. This is cute. I'll still stick this on the fridge. <laughs> I love it. Okay, let's put this aside. I'll put all the cover minders together and all the washi tape will go together in their own drawer. And we got a couple stickers. <laughs> That's cute. <gasps> Look how stinking cute. I love her. Oh. And look. Jack be riding the struggle bus just like me. I, I run the struggle bus all the damn time. Look. Oh. How cute. And look, a rainbow. Awesome. This bag, I like this bag. This is out of all the little, I get all these baggies from uh, Etsy, you know, with candy and stuff inside. This is the prettiest one I've seen yet. Okay. So the first thing that came in the package, she found this little cinnamon roll um, toothbrush. <laughs> and it has little, um, oh my God, I'm dropping things. A little cover in here. I'm going to figure out what I'm going to use this for. Honestly, I was looking for a little um, baby toothbrush to brush my uh, ferret's teeth. <laughs> and it has to be this size and soft. I, I may just use this for my children so they have their own little special cinnamon roll brush. <laughs> I love it. It's so clever. And next she got me a little notebook with cinnamon roll my dude oh how stinking cute he is with his little lemonade this is the part right, you 
read that. It has the little Hello Kitty bows on the top. I could technically use this for a um a log book. Uh, I've been meaning, to, you know, I've been collecting um the big stickers that come with the labels and my diamond art clubs and I've been saving them with all the dates written on them and stuff and I've been looking for a book I I know I had bought one and I lost it in my basement somewhere but I've been looking for a notebook to stick them in to write the notes um, on my diamond art clubs and maybe I will use this you know stick the um the large sticker on one page and then write all the notes next to it I think that would be a good idea good thinking Jack <laughs> And next, she found this really, really cool thing. Let me move you out a little bit. This is a cinnamon roll uh, reed diffuser. It has lavender oil in it. Um, if you guys don't know what this is, it's a oil diffuser. Now, I'm pretty sure um, this won't harm my fur children um, because reed diffusers aren't... Um, I, at least I haven't smelt a strong one yet. Um, so I'm going to put this up really high away from my kids. Oh my God, it has blue sticks like cinnamon roll. Oh my God, I'm going to die. Who's on the bottle, you guys? Isn't he cute? He's so precious. Now, y'all gonna kill me. I'm going to. I know everybody's gonna kill me for doing this. I'm. This is my diamond painting. This is Threads of the Universe. You guys are looking at, but not looking at, because it's covered by uh, release paper. Um, and I already told you on uh, Camilla de Erico on Rosea, I spill oil, salmon oil, my ferret's salmon oil all over it. And this is oil again. And um, I'm not going to, I am not going to pour this on top of my canvas. I'm, I'm just not going to do it. I'll pour it over the carpet. <laughs> got to be very 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 careful I love the smell of lavender you guys I would put this next to my bed but my little fur children get over there and I don't want them eating the sticks because Miss Buster Brown would be the one that eat the sticks okay so the oil the lavender oil is poured in and then in case you don't know how to to do these one, two, three, four. I thought there was supposed to be five. One, two, three, four, five. Am I missing one? Did I drop one? Oh, it's in the box. Okay, you put the oil in your bottle. It comes with a bottle. It comes with the oil. You put your oil in the bottle. The top of the bottle should be um, open. And then you just arrange your your sticks and let them sit in there and over time they soak up the oil and then creates a nice smell in the room so we're gonna put that aside I'm gonna find a nice place for it maybe over by my plants um, I love it I love it and it smells absolutely delightful let's put all this stuff in here now I wonder, um, can I, I've never reused these before. I wonder if I can buy the oil to refill the bottle once it's empty and then find new, do you, do you buy new reed sticks when you want to put a different oil in there? How does that go? Um, here's the last gift. She bought me a crochet kit. <laughs> That is so thoughtful. And look, it's the crochet a little taco. Oh, that is so cute. I I am up to my neck with crochet kits, you guys. Um, I just keep buying them and buying and buying them, anticipating that I'm going to do them. And then I always end up working on a really, really big project. But I, I save them, honestly, 
for the time where I don't want, there's going to be a common time where I don't want to do a big project and I want to do something that's going to be a quick finish. Kind of the same concept as the diamond paintings. You know, I, I like doing my big ones from Diamond Art Club, but when I want a quick finish, I go to my 30 by 40s. So I've been saving up all, all types of little mini kits, um, for one day when I want a um, quick finish. So this comes with everything you may need. If you don't know what a crochet kit is, if you crochet, comes the kit comes with the yarn to make it, uh, string, stuffing, it actually comes with a little crochet hook, but I have my own, uh, yarn needle, the uh, safety eyes. So it comes with everything you, um... oh, see? <laughs> It's telling me that I must use the hook included, but I will just take the hook and um, size it to my real ones, like, you know, my nice metal ones, and just find the similar size. Um, how cute is this? I love tacos. I love Taco Bell, you guys. <laughs> it's super, super adorable. I don't want to take everything out. I just want to peek inside. scissors. I'm making a mess everywhere. So just to show you guys, see it comes with everything you need. This is a really small hook. I wonder what size this is. That's got to be like a three. Here a little polyfill. That is super cute. Okay, I'm gonna keep it in the original packaging now because I uh, don't want anything to get lost. I love everything. I simply love everything. So we got the book, got a little cinnamon roll toothbrush. We got our um, lavender cinnamon roll um, air freshener diffuser. And we got our cute little crochet taco kit. and. We got some cool ass washi tapes, ones that I don't even have yet. I will love to use these. Some nice stickers. And we got some cool cover reminders for our fridge when we move the fridge up to my room for my surgery in a month. I'm so excited about this. Thank you, a big, big, big thank you to Jack. Thank you so much for thinking of me, friend. Um, it is really really thoughtful of you and really kind of you I really really appreciate the gifts I'm, I'm in love with everything this will definitely probably most likely become a log book so I'm really excited about that um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing me open up some happy meal and if you guys are new here don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're enjoying the content here on this channel and if you're returning thank you for returning and joining me in today's video and without further ado i hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and a wonderful day and night wherever you are and a big thank you again to jack from diamond painting um with jack i will link her down below and don't forget to check out her channel and i hope you guys have a good day or night wherever you are. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.